What's up guys, it's your favorite Q coach. Welcome back to another video. This video is gonna be about our new online service. It's gonna be about our live Zoom call, 45 minute. It's the closest you can get to an online lesson. Let's go do this thing. So welcome back to the channel guys. If you guys are new to QB Golf Japan, we do a bunch of videos like this every single week. So what you gotta go do is hit that little red subscribe button, smash the like button, leave a comment, and as always, share the video, it really does help. Let's hop into the first part of this video. Okay, so starting off the service, what we typically like to do is let's just kind of talk about what he's currently working on with golf swing, what he's struggling with, etc. えっと、あの、僕のスイングをあの、インスタグラムでお送りしたんですけど、あの、正面から撮った動画なんですけど、ちょっと左にスウェーがあの、入り気味かなっていうのがちょっと悩みではあるんですけど。What else uh, anything else besides that? 他に何か気になる点とかありますか? I see. Now, in terms of swing mechanics, what is he trying to do to combat that? Like, what is he? Is he trying to shout the club more? Like, what is? テイクバックが僕は右にスウェーする癖があったのでそれをあの中心軸でテイクバックできるようにしてであのダウンスイングでもあのスウェーテイクバックでスウェーした時にそれに合わせてダウンスイングでスウェーまた左にしてしまってた
Yeah, so we'll kind of show him um, a couple more things of what he should be focused on when he's doing this. So I think what he's currently doing is he's not getting his left side shoulder low enough, and he's also, I don't think, getting um, enough front bend. Mm.で、で、もう2点マイクさん気になるところあるそうで、このP5のポジションで分かるのが左肩をがちょっと高いんですね。ああ、はい。あの、右肩が上がりに左肩を下げ足りないっていう状態になってるのと、あの、フロントベンドっていう前傾がちょっと起き上がり始めてる。ああ、はい。ありましたね。今、左と比べたときに、やっぱりちょっ
そうじゃなくて左ソックスを入れるために胸の真ん中がちょうど左かかとの上に来るようなイメージでちょっと練習してみてくださいよく分かりますはい、yeah. so、them, them do is, we call it covering the golf ball more which is getting your chest more on top これよく英語でカバーリングっていうのはこれですねボールの上を胸の真ん中がカバーしていくように上半身を使っていくことをカバーリングっていうんですけどアイアンショットとかあとカットす打つ時とかねカバーリングしますよね、yeah. And that's gonna help you with compressing the golf ball as well as you're probably gonna see your trajectory lower just slightly で、まあ、効果としては弾道が低くなりやすくなったりとかあとはえー、もっとインパクトでボールを潰せるようになるっていうことですね。うん。で、今のって聞いて一連の流れでその理解できなかった点とかあれば、あの、はい、知ってもらえればもうちょっとあの努力します。砕いて<笑>言えるように。あ、でも今の説明でもすごいとてもよくわかりました。Very good. Okay, so let's real quickly because we got about probably.、Uh, Eight more minutes, we're going to do this thing. So, I'm going to real quickly share the screen and let's go check out his down the line view. Now, with his down the line view, is there any、uh, points of interest that he's really focused on? なんか聞いておきたいとかでも。えっ、ー、と P6 がちょっと昔からあのアンダープレイになる癖があるので、それの直し方とかが知りたいんですけど。うん、Underneath the plane? Yeah, around P6. So that's probably tell him what we just told him is probably actually going to help that quite significantly. But let's show him another swing where I think he'll get a great visual. で今言ったことやっていただけると、多分アンダーニースはもう治るだろう。ああ、そうですか。右に直接入るとヘッドって垂れやすいじゃないですか。ああ、そうですね。はい。これはあの長谷川翔平プロっていう方なんですけど。So、翔平、はい、told me in the last lesson he wanted to be the model swing that I use for everyone. So... <笑> And that's Leo, by the way. すみません。大丈夫です。So... Here, let's go take a look at kind of your position six. So, here's kind of the underneath the plane that he's taking a that he's talking about, right? Now, let's go take a look at Shohei's real quick. Pretty good, right? So, tell him what are, what, what are some of the differences he personally sees. で今ご自身が見てなんか違うと思う点をいくつか述べてもらいたいんですけど、えっ、ー、とまず前傾がちょっとふあの長谷川プロ深いのと、ね、あと P6 の腰の回転度合いが僕の方がちょっとオーバーローテーションになってて、それが違うかなと思います。Absolutely. So I want real quickly. I think a lot of it has to do with his initial transition move. So we're gonna really quickly zoom up, and I want him to take a look at what his hips do relative to kind of what Shohei's is doing. あのおっしゃった通りなので、じゃちょっとそこを踏まえて見ていきますね。腰の動きを一緒に見ていきます。So let's watch your kind of motion here. これ切り返しからダウンスイング入る時の動きですね。So he has initial good move, but I think he he doesn't. <laughs> He doesn't continue to get lower, right? So, this is the first one. The first one 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 is the f i r e s t one. The first one is the first one. The first one is the first one. You see the difference? He's continuing to go into front bend and continuing to stay in flexion, basically. Right? Much more APT, yeah. And a lot of that has to do with this front bend added to that. That'll help with the anterior pelvic tilt. その骨盤の前傾ももちろんなんですけど、胸が地面に近いっていうのも結構違うということです。<laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So basically,、um, do the drill that we just kind of talked about. That's really going to help him out. And at first, you're going to hit a lot of chunk shots just because your right arm's not used to staying flex. It's going to extend. 
そのままずドリルやってもらうと何が起こるかっていうとまず最初絶対ダフるのがちょっと多くなるんですねでなぜなら起き上がった姿勢でボールを拾っていく動きに右肘が慣れちゃってるので新しく前傾を深くする動きするとあのダフりがかなり最初は増えます。But then, so then you're, you're going to learn to hold on to that right elbow angle. You're going to start hearing a different sound when he hits the ball. It's going to be coming a lot more compressed, a lot more. And then, but 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 then, あ最初はちょっとダフると思うんですけど、yeah. そのうち綺麗にこう打てるようになってくるのであわかりました、はい、OK so real quickly let me go back to Zoom so here's a great time to wrap up、uh, he can kind of tell us what type of questions he has、um, if we answer all his questions and then maybe the video testimony at the end、うん、で一応以上が、まあ、ビデオ分析ライブのになるんですけど、はい、え、はい、今日の総括して何か質問とか改めてあればどうぞ何かえっ、ー、と質問はうんああの僕ちょっとあのマイクコーチが今日あの教えてくださったあの左肩を低くするのを前やったことがあるんですけど、うん、あのその時にやっぱどうしても入射角があの、うん、なんですかきつくなってあのかなりもう低いライナーのボールしか出ないことがあったんですけど、うん、それってちょっと入射角ってどうやってレベルぐらいにするのかなって思っちゃいたいんですけど。うん yeah, yeah, yeah. And let me explain why. Because most people when they get the left bend, They also open their shoulders.、Mm. So they get left in with rotation early in transition. That gets the steep AOA、mm. if you stay in flexion. So, if you look at the left side, the left side is a little bit of 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 a l i t t Very common with a lot of our students. Everyone's trying to rotate their chest more because the rotational swing, but they rotate way too early. There needs to be a sequence, right? The rotational swing is a lot of people who are going to be able to do it. The first thing is that 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 the first thing This little front bend comes into play because、mm. if you go left bend and you front bend, notice how my shoulders aren't opening when I do that. And then right around position five, that's when you can start continuing to get the left shoulder low. And start opening up your chest. Then you're going to have not super steep AOA. And this is what you're going to do. You're going to be able to do it. You're going to be able to do it.